Hello and welcome back to Rovers Jack YouTube channel. I'm sitting down for a quick video as I hand out my player ratings from Rovers 2-1 victory over Middlesbrough. Before I start, remember to hit like and subscribe. Check out the match reaction from yesterday and you can also check out the added time show that will be out on Monday at 8am as always as we look into the match and a bit of a Monday night football analysis show. But let's get into the play ratings. NZ Pay 6, I thought he did well. I thought in the air he was at times struggling and maybe a bit flappy at times, but other times he was quite commanding. So I think a six is fair. Couldn't have done anything about the offside goal, but it is what it is. Callum Britton, a perfect performance for the right back. I think it might mean that JRC moves into the midfield on Wednesday against Sunderland and uh, Britton keeps his right back spot because he played really well. You can't really drop him after that performance. Dom Hyam, seven. I thought he was good at the back. Solid, lead head and Carter well. Really put in a show in that. Dom Hayam does as the captain without the armband, really. I thought he was really good and just a solid defender, as always. Hayden Carter, seven, brought the ball out of defence really well, got the assist for the goal, uh, the first one for Smodic. I thought he did really well and just showed why he's going to be this choice, uh, first choice centre back partnership with Hayam, despite the loan sign in the hill, despite Scott Wharton being sat on the bench. Harry Pickering, seven. Mr. Reliable, Mr. Seven every game, really. Did what he needed to, got us forward well. Solid defensively. Lewis Travis, seven, really combative, really what we expect from Trav. Picked the ball in mid midfield. Got us forward well as well. I think he played more of an attacking role than he usually plays, but he did that perfectly. And for me, he's been the player of the season so far and one may continue. Adam Wharton, seven, usual Adam Wharton. Good with a ball at his feet. For the second goal, he does that half turn like no one else really can in the team. Turns his man really well and gets us forward, knocks it past two. And we're suddenly in the attack. I think it was a really good showing from Adam and continues to make his stop rise. Hedge is seven. Now, I think Hedge had a good game. I thought he brought the ball under control really well, got us forward well. Some good passing, some good uh, dribbling forward, did what he needed to and, you know, bounced back really from that Plymouth showing. Smodic's nine man of the match, as always. Uh, two goals for him. Should have really had an hat trick, but just really solid. Did what he needed to. At first, I was maybe concerned about his performance for the first 10 minutes and then suddenly came into life, proved me wrong, shut me up. That's why he's a professional footballer and I'm not. Terry Stolen 5, I thought he actually struggled out wide. Kept trying to do the stuff that he didn't need to. He sometimes should just keep it simple and he didn't here. When he does keep it simple, he looks good. He looks like a solid option. He looks like the play we know he can be, but just overcomplicates it at times. And Sam Gallagher, seven, led the line really well, dummied for the goal, deserves an assist really, but it doesn't go down as is. But just a really good showing from Sam uh, and what we asked from him up front. Tillalovic, six, did all right, you know, won a few aerial duels, seemed to show that he knew what we're trying to do, just sometimes a little off the pace, but that'll come with time, so I'm not massively concerned about it. Moran, six, I don't think he impacted the game too much, but showed a bit, you know, a bit of a, a more defensive side to him. I feel these games are hard to judge these attacking players coming off and Rovers are trying to hold out for the win. They're not going to get much. They're going to do a lot of chasing and I think he did enough. JRC6 sat quite deep actually when he came on but did when he needed to. Got Rovers forward, made the tackles when he should have and just really the performance you need off the bench for a midfielder coming in. I'd like to see him there actually on Wednesday night. And James Hill and Harry Lennon, no rating because obviously they, uh, they came off the bench late. But that's where I ran off. Just a quick video there, handing out my ratings as Rovers beat Middlesbrough 2 1. Thank you very much for watching. Hit like, hit subscribe, do all that stuff. Keep supporting us. The results for the FCAs are out next week, a week on Monday. We'll find out whether we made the final 10. So keep tuned and we'll let you know if we do. But thank you for watching. Yeah.